everyone and welcome. We are the Tsivons group, composed by Michele Gotzer, Kristen Nicosia and Marta Tsivonchuk. Our project deals with the dengue virus. The information we found were from to the site of virus scanner and our coach Thomas Langerak. Now let's talk about the dengue virus. The dengue virus is a feverish disease that affects infants, children and also adults. There are four types of dengue virus that only differ a bit of each other. It is transmitted through mosquito bites and it's highly prevalent in tropical regions. Mosquitoes ingest blood with dengue virus. It takes 10 to 12 days for dengue virus to incubate. There are 390 million infections per year. The disease is transmitted by mosquitoes of genus Aedes, which in turn point on an infected person. There is therefore no direct contagion between women, even if men in the main host of the virus. The virus circulates in the blood on, of the infected person for two to seven days, and in this period the mosquitoes can take and transmit it to others. The dengue has been known for over two centuries and is particularly present during and after the rainy season in the tropical and subtropical zones of Africa, Southeast Asia and China, India, Middle East, Latin and Central America, also Australia and several areas of the Pacific. Normally, the disease gives rise to fever within three to seven days from the mosquito bite, with even a very high temperatures. This fever is accompanied by acute edges, pain around and behind the eye, severe muscle and joint pain, nausea and vomiting, skin irritation that may appear on most of the body after three to four days from onset of fever. Typical symptoms are often absent in children. The most effective preventive measures against dengue fever is to avoid contact with virus carrying mosquitoes. They therefore become practical priorities such as the use to repentels sweep table and protective clothing mosquitoes net and contains. Since mosquitoes are more active in the early morning hours. It is particularly important to use protection in this part of the day. Our final product is a leaflet explaining the virus transmission, symptoms, preventions and treatments. Our goal is to help people prevent it through their knowledge. Hypothetically, by giving these flyers to tourist agencies that target the areas most affected by dengue fever, where later the agencies will give their passengers a simple sheet of paper and with the information necessary to avoid the contagion. Right from the start, our goal was to help people prevent dengue virus and we think these products can be useful for our goal. We thank you for your attention and hope that our explanation and proposal may have helped. Goodbye and remember, knowledge is the best antivirus.